Hey guys, so today I thought it'd be fun to show you guys what I am planning on putting in Harper's stocking. So as I mentioned in a previous video, this is actually my first year doing stockings and I don't know if I'm the only one, but <laughs> for some reason I thought it was really intimidating to stuff stockings. I feel like you're just spending so much money on the actual like toys and presents underneath the tree that to then spend money filling a stocking and finding the perfect stocking stuffers, um, it just seemed a little bit intimidating to me. Um, and so I think I bought too much. <laughs> now um, I'm seeing that it's not intimidating at all and that you actually don't need a ton to fill a stocking. Um, but I didn't know that before. So we're gonna see what actually fits in here. I might have to just put some of these things underneath the tree. But this is Harper's stocking. I got it from Target. It's kind of like a yarn. Um, fabric and I think that it's super cute um, it has like a silk inside and so it doesn't stretch so if you're buying stockings still um, and you really want to stuff those stockings maybe get one without an inner lining because I think that if it was without the inner lining it would be able to stretch but this one doesn't <laughs> So, but that could also be a good thing because it means that you don't need a ton to fill it. So, um, the first, I'm just gonna grab things at random and probably just show you guys everything that I got and then we'll get to stuffing the stocking. Um, so I got her this little bird to go inside of it. I'm going to have to take this out of the packaging for it to fit. Um, but it says, I record and repeat every word. And so I thought that she would just absolutely love having a little bird that she can put in her hand that repeats what she is saying. I think she's gonna love that and I'm gonna love watching her play with it. Then I got her this bath foam. This is kind of, it came in a pack of two. I'm only gonna put one in there. It is foam soap and it says shape, sculpt, and create. And this is the grape um, scent. So she just loves taking a bath. So any kind of fun bath things that I can get her, I always keep my eye out for them. She loves playing with the bubbles and she kind of tries to mold. She'll like make a pile of bubbles and like try to mold it into something. And so, and it doesn't really work because the bubbles just pop. So she's gonna really love this um, bath foam. You could also do this with shaving cream, I'm sure. <laughs> Next to that, I found these that I think will be really fun. So they're from the Mr. Bubble line too. Um, and it is magic bath crackles. And so I think that these are like pop rocks, the pop rock candies that you put in your mouth and they like fizzle and pop. I think that these are pop rocks for your bathtub. Um, so we'll see how these work. It was only like 99 cents or less maybe even. Um, and so I just thought it'd be something fun for us to give a whirl inside of the bathtub. I don't know if this is going to fit. Um, if not, I will just give it to her underneath the tree, but she loves those um, mess-free markers. She plays with them every day. And so these are kind of more of like a paintbrush style ones. And so I thought that she would just really like these. Maybe I'll just put the markers themselves in the stocking. I got her these um, Play-Dohs that are in the shapes of crayons. I went ahead and took them out. So this is what they look like. Um, so I think that she's gonna love these. She loves playing with Play-Dohs. She actually already saw these and she flipped out and wanted me to give them to her immediately. <laughs> they stack really nicely, so that's cool. Ah! <laughs> except for not. <laughs> they stack nicely, you just can't dance with them afterwards. She loves these mint Hershey Kisses, we all do. We are all big fans of these in our family. Um, and so I have just a small handful of these that I'm gonna put in her stocking. And then I got her these um, Jelly Belly flavored candy canes. I like them because they were like blue and pink and purple and they look really fun. And then last but not least, I got her a Skittles um, candy cane. I actually opened this up because I made her a treat and I needed some Skittles for the treat and so I already opened these up and stole a few but she'll never know. Okay so now I have to try to fit all of that in here. This is the little birdie. I think that he is so cute. She's gonna love it. I'm probably gonna put batteries in this so that she can play with it Christmas morning. Or what, what do people do? I don't know because I've never done um, stockings before, as I've said a hundred times during Vlogmas. <laughs> 
Um, and I don't remember what we did as kids. Do you open stockings on Christmas Eve or do you open them Christmas morning? I don't know. But I'm gonna, should I put this guy in first? Maybe I will put the Play-Doh in first. So I have the Play-Dohs in here and they go to like up to here. So I think, I think we're rocking and rolling. I'm gonna put the bath bubbles in here and the little pop rocks, the candies. I think we have plenty of room. What was I worried about before? Let's open this guy. For these markers, they sell these markers individually and then they also sell the regular um, mess-free markers that aren't in this shape separately. And I definitely think that those are a great stocking stuffer. If you haven't bought them before, just know that you do need the special like pad with it. But I'm just gonna set the pad aside and put it with her other pads. And I will put these fun new markers. She's really, really gonna love these. And I'm just gonna put these in her stocking. Yay, I'm stuffing a stocking. I'm such a mom. <laughs> Life is good. I am gonna put her Skittles in here. Is there a rhyme or reason when you're stuffing a stocking? I feel like I'm just throwing everything in here and it's working. So yeah, her bird is gonna go at the top and then I just need her candy canes and we'll be set. Yay! They're not broken. Oh, I have a sweet little two-year-old. Okay, I'm gonna just put these in here. Do you hang them off the side? Is that what cute people do? or something, I don't know. If I do that, she's gonna see them and want to grab them. So I'm just gonna put them in here where they will probably get broken. Um, but that is everything. Her, her stocking is definitely nice and stuffed. It comes up to here, not too heavy, but there's lots of fun goodies in there. And I'm super excited for her to open this Christmas Eve or Christmas morning. You guys are gonna have to tell me which one. Um, but yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. And if you haven't stuffed your stockings yet, I hope that maybe you got some ideas. If you have any more fun ideas of what you put in your kid's stocking this year, go ahead and leave them down in the comments below so that if people are looking for ideas, they can see your ideas. Um, so yeah, that's gonna do it for today's video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.